I've done dreadful things, monstrous things, and there will be a price. Do you remember when I first came to London? You have the only two things worth having, looks and youth. I suggest we raise a little help. You're perfect. This is not my true face. We never age. What are you? I am what you made me! What's your secret? If I told you, I'd have to kill you. How terrifying. What's in there? Give me the chain! I have seen my soul. And there will be a price. I've done dreadful things, monstrous things, and there will be a price. This is not my true face. I think what attracted me to the part was um, just the journey that the character goes on. He starts off as this very vulnerable 21-year-old kid, basically. And then he meets Henry Wooten, by whom he's, he's corrupted. This is my church. With this tram, right now, I nail my soul to the devil's altar. You'll never meet a more eloquent philosopher of pure folly. Basil, I think, has a, a rather pure delight in, in Dorian, and it's the initial purity and, and sheer aesthetic beauty of Dorian which, which makes him want to capture that on, on canvas. Henry's fascinated with it in a different way. He wants to mess with it. He wants to disrupt it. He does it, I think, in, in my mind, he does it initially just to tease Basil and to provoke him with his, this newfound joy of his. Yeah. In one. No, don't, don't. <coughs> Barkeeper. <coughs> Again. But as time goes on, for all sorts of rather mm, tangled motives, um, he wants to... He wants to break it down. He wants to see this phenomenon of, 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 of beauty um, tarnished in some way. I suggest we raise a little hell. What actually motivates this man? It's very, very, very hard to actually put your finger on. People die of common sense, Dorian. One last moment at a time. Life is a moment. There's no hereafter. So make it burn always with the hardest flame. He destroys Dorian completely, really. He doesn't see that to its conclusion because if he sets Dorian on a path where he'll destroy himself. But it's definitely Henry that initiates that process. Perhaps I should nail my soul to the devil's altar. Remain as you are. Fair trade. How about another gin instead? All that hocus pocus. Endless conjurations, books bound in infant skin, tentacles of fire, drinking the blood of virgins. Dorian wouldn't really part of his soul. Would you, Dorian? Would you? Yes. Never age. Ever scar. What are you? I am what you made me. What's your secret? If I told you, I'd have to kill you. How terrifying. What's in there? Give me the chain! I have seen my soul. And there will be a price. Ah!